Hello everyone, welcome back to Dentistry Made Easy. Earlier we have seen the Zygmondi Palmer tooth numbering system. Now moving on towards the next tooth numbering system that is known as Federation Dentier International System. In short, it is the FDI system. So this system except United States, it is widely used everywhere. So this system, it was proposed by Dr. Joshen Woyle of Berlin in 1970. Now, according to this system, there are two digits. So earlier in Zygmondi Palmer, we have seen that we have the quadrant system and we have only single digit. So this is your central incisor. This was your lateral incisor, the right sided, the left sided one. So this was the way for your Zygmondi Palmer. But for FDI, it is the two digit system so the first digit it denotes the quadrant similarly over here also we have seen in zygmondi palmer so you have four quadrants but over here in zygmondi palmer you are not writing the quadrant number whereas in fdi you write the quadrant number first whether it is first quadrant or second quadrant or third quadrant or the fourth quadrant and the second digit is the number of your tooth so this numbering it is done in the clockwise manner starting from the maxillary right side that means your maxillary right side is your first quadrant maxillary left side is your second quadrant mandibular left quadrant is your third number and your mandibular right sided is your fourth quadrant so these are the quadrant number this system it is simple and easy and it is more communicable now for example if you are writing 27 so 2 is the quadrant and 7 is the tooth number so that is your second molar so this is nothing but the left sided maxillary second molar this is how it looks like the first quadrant is your upper right quadrant, second number is your upper left, third is your lower left and fourth is your lower right. And accordingly, same similarly as we have seen in Zygmondi Palmer, one is your central, two is your lateral incisor, three is your canine, first premolar, second premolar, first molar, second molar and the third molar. So this is how the FDI system is. Now example if you are seeing is, so what is the FDI system with respect to the upper left first premolar. Now over here this is the upper left. So first we are going to write about the quadrant. So in this it is about the left upper. So over here 2 is your quadrant number. So the first digit is your quadrant and the second is your tooth number. So first premolar is nothing but digit 4. So the first premolar is your 4. So that is nothing but 2, 4. Similarly, the next example can be lower right central incisor. Lower right is your fourth quadrant and central incisor is number 1. So this is how the FDI system works for the permanent dentition. Now for the primary dentition, the quadrant number, it changes. That means the upper right is the 5 number, upper left is 6. Then lower left is 7 and lower right is 8. Similarly, there are 5 teeth as you know. First is central incisor, lateral incisor, then canine, first molar and the second molar. So the example will be if what is the FDI system for the lower right canine. So it will be lower right. That means lower right is your 8 number. So the quadrant it will be 8 and the next is the canine. So canine is 3. So it will be 8, 3. So this is all about the FDI system. I hope you found this video helpful and if you did then please like, comment, share and do subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.